Hello guys, today I will show you how to use Unity with Visual Studio. Um, it's really simple, but please ensure that you have Unity Pro and Visual Studio, um, the full version. That's important because otherwise it won't work. I have tried it before. So, um, the only thing we need is a plugin, um, Unity 4S. Um, you can find it on unity4s.com, I will link it in the description. Um, that's a uh, uh, Visual Studio plugin, but also a Unity plugin. Um, but first we have to download the whole thing. Um, we go on the site and her here we find our Visual Studio version. Um, in my case it's Visual Studio 2013. And um, yeah, just download that. You will forward to um, msdn.microsoft.com how you can find a lot of very useful um, tools and plugins for Visual Studio. Yeah, but um, for now just download this one. It's free. And if you download it, just install it. It will install a plugin for Visual Studio 2013. And also it will install some files. For example, um, if you have a new project, you, no you need to import the um, Unity plugin and you can find it if you type in your search bar um, Visual Studio, I think, yeah. Then you can find here your Visual Studio 2013 tools for Unity as a Unity package. You press enter and it will install in your project. It takes a minute or a second. Um, here you select all and press import. And that's um, you have to do each time if you uh, create a new Unity project. But um, after that it's really, really simple. Um, if it won't work, if uh, uh, in the console view there should appear this message. If not, you can just, or if it's bugged or something like that, you can just here, up there, um, Visual Studio Tools generate project files. Okay. Now you can notice that um, if you go on under file, um, no, edit preferences, you can see under external tools, you can see here the um, external script editor arcs um, and the external script editor is um, here a selected Unity 4S. And yeah, that, oh, I've just fucked it. Can I reset it? Or have I? Oh, that's bad. Okay, um, yeah, I just had to re-import it, and um, the line that was missing here um, now is back here. Um, yeah, but um, yeah, that's all. You can check if it wor uh, worked here. If um, here is selected Unity 4S, all is okay. Okay, then we can uh, just open Visual Studio or double click um, a script. And that will open automatically Visual Studio. And not only that, you can debug with Visual Studio. You can, um, you have a um, debug profile for Unity. Um, that's from the plugin that we installed. And it's really complex. You can have, uh, you can debug. You can um, the project files are synced between the Unity and Visual Studio. And yeah, if something went wrong, you can you can try generate project files. Um, and if the auto complete, if the auto completion won't work anymore, you just have to um, close all Unity uh, Visual Studio tabs and yeah, reopen Visual Studio with. By, by clicking, uh, double clicking a script or here open Visual Studio. Yeah, and um, that's all. You can configure it here um, some things like um, the extensions that should open with um, Visual Studio. And uh, yeah, I can, oh yeah, and the console is sent to the Visual Studio debug console. That's very useful. Um, I would recommend to, yeah, just let the settings here as they are. 
um, yeah, I hope uh, you enjoyed the video. Um, if you liked it, you can like my video. And yeah, bye.